na serikali inapania kuboresha magereza humu nchini kufikia viwango vya kimataifa katibu wa idara ya urekebishaji tabia Mary Mudhoni amesema korokoro za humu nchini ziko katika hali duni bila vifaa vya kimsingi Serikali ya taifa imeweka mikakati madhubuti ya kuboresha magereza ya humu nchini na kama sehemu ya juhudi hizo katibu wa idara ya urekebishaji tabia Mary Muthoni alikuwa katika kaunti ya Wasingishu kuhimiza ushirikiano na serikali ya kaunti kuafikia lengo hilo Katibu huyo aliyezuru magereza ya eneo hilo akiandamana na gavana wa Wasingishu Jonathan B aligusia swala la kushirikisha taasisi hizo katika uzalishaji chakula His Excellency is very much focused about food security and we have vast land as uh, uh, correctional services and uh, more so land that uh, we have housed our prisons. It is the very um, best time now to look into ways and means of utilizing this land. Alisema serikali na mipanga kukarabati magereza ya humu nchini ili ya afikiwe viwango vya kima taifa. There are prisons which were built during the colonial era to punish Africans. So the very first thing that we should think about is not even about how we will do it, how much. It is to think that we need to improve the standards of the infrastructure of our prisons. Katibu alisema lengo kula kuboreshwa kwa vituo hivyo ni kupunguzwa kwa msongamano ili kuwapa wafungwa hadhi yao ya kibinadamu. Sometimes coming into conflict with the law does not mean that it is the end of the world. These people change and they change for the better. We should not take our cases to take a long time in those courts. We can really go into this alternative uh, resolution method that it's coming up. John Jacob Curia, Darubini.